Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's me, Chris, and remember the Pokemon Wi-Fi battle and Sword and Shield against Ritz. He's got that new Moltres. Nice. Celesteela. I'm gonna lose. <laughs> I'm gonna lose, dude. Tangrowth? Oh, Tangrowth counters... Thunderous. Um... I think Buster is the only thing that can beat it. Alright, I'm just gonna open with Cuckoo. Yeah, actually, my team is so, so bad. Like, what the heck? Oh. Weakness policy, Aegislash. So I'm, I'm excited to see that in UU. So I do like, I was having a lot of fun playing in this tier, but I think I know why my teams weren't doing so hot. There are some games I'd be able to run away with, but others that I really can't. Uh, we got to deal with that Tangrowth. Oh. He leads out with Excadrill, the Skawa. Leads out with Skawa. We open up with Cuckoo. We're definitely gonna be slower. Do we just Drain Punch? Does he have a Ghost type? He doesn't have a ghost type. We're probably going to get knocked off here, which will be unfortunate. We're going to lose our Toxic Orb. Maybe he thinks... What else is Conkelder's... I don't know what Conkelder's other ability is. Maybe it has no guard like Machamp. Maybe he puts us on that. Because I'm not usually a Guts Pokemon user. But Shiny Excadrill looks... Really nice. And noticing that his name is Scala, I think we're going to see like a nice little theme here. Uh, okay, he goes into Apex Let. That is not the theme I was expecting. As a Drain Punch is going to do decent damage, actually. This thing is flying type, though. So it kind of does work. Um, do we have a swap? Mm. I guess we could go Buster. Maybe we go Scrapper. Oh, I should have... I made last minute changes to this team. I made some last minute changes to this team. So we'll go Scrapper. Maybe a Mock Punch would have been like good enough, but... Celesteela, probably a sub-seed set. Yeah, we see a Protect. Um, here, I'm more than happy to just click Knock Off. I used... I, man, I ran Moltres in the Thunderous slot before. I ran Moltres. That's why I ran Moltres. It was for, like, Celesteela. Legit. Celesteela and Skarmory. Only reason. But I last minute put Moltres on the bench for Thunderous. Thunderous T, because I've never used Thunderous T, and I've been actually using Moltres a lot on uh, BD SP. Oh, good old, good old freaking uh, Celesteela or Ultra Beast. That's what these things are called. So I'll knock off the lefties. Ooh, Heavy Slam's gonna hurt. I think that kills us. Oh no. Yeah, we're especially defensive. Or not. We're just defensive. We are a defensive set. And I'm just going to go ahead and use this opportunity to get up the Stealth Rocks. Because after seeing how much damage that did, I don't think he stays in. I think he's like, oh, this thing's physically defensive. Yikes. Looks like he's going to stay in. Uh, what does he have for us? Leech Seed. Yeah, he's gonna blast us with a Leech Seed, which is cool. Um. May go for a Protect. Like, we want to get Thunderous, but Thunderous cannot take a Heavy Slam. Like, not at all. Like, Thunderous will get bopped. Um. Buster? 
Do we go Buster? Dude, this tier is so weird. So many Pokemon. I don't know what to do. Withdraws Apex Legends. Goes into Shofu. Ooh, that is, uh, that is not good for us. That is actually really bad for us. That is uh, really bad for us. <laughs> that might be the worst for us. Um... We just go back into Scrapper. Maybe predicting the Flare Blitz. At least getting the Intimidate off. We have our Stealth Rocks up, which are like very important. We see Heavy Duty Boots on the Darmanitan. What are these themes of Pokemon that he's like named? Scrapper comes in, drops the Intimidate. We see an Earthquake. Ouch. You know, that's... Pretty solid damage. Mm. You want to click Earthquake, but I'm just going to click Knock Off. Oh, he is Heavy Duty Boots, though. I'm, I'm like, hard assuming... F Scarf, but we already saw Heavy Duty Boots because he didn't take damage from the rocks. So, I don't know what coverage moves this guy could get. Probably a punch. Oh, U-Turn might kill us. Oh, U-Turn does solid damage. Does not exactly KO, but... Yo, that's solid, solid damn. And Shofu's gonna be a problem with those heavy-duty boots. Like, I wish there was a way we could get those boots off Shofu's feet. But Apex Legends comes back. And I hope this knockoff KOs. Oh, man. I don't even know if one more knockoff KOs. But we have to try. Come on, Scrapper. Dig deep. Dig deep! And yes. Alright. We take out the Celesteela, which is like a big threat. Earthquakes are now free. You know, I like Scrapper. But Earthquake with Tapu Bulu, it just doesn't... It doesn't synergize very well. Heavy Duty Boots are just too good, dude. Heavy duty boots are too good. <laughs> Man. I'm also glad that, like, I've been seeing a lot of slow bro, a lot of teleport pivots in UU. Like, Sword and Shield is such a crazy way to battle. It's so different than BDSP OU. Like, I'll just get, like, bopped on Sword and Shield on Showdown, and I'm just like, I just need to go back to BDSP OU. I gotta. <laughs> I, I have a, a grasp. On that metagame, so it's fun. Goes into spin cycle, so it's a Rotom. No heavy duty boots on Rotom. Um. Ooh, we're gonna get Willow Wisped here. We're gonna get Willow Wisped because he's gonna see Bulu, like for sure, a thousand percent. We're about to get neutered, but. But it's okay. It just be like that. Uh, a hydro pump, actually. Uh, we sort of kind of take that. Meaning we actually really do take that. Um, what does he do here? I think we just... Okay, yeah, we have to... We can't hit Toxic. I think we Dazzling Gleam. I mean, I don't think he comes in with the Excadrill. He's going to hit the Will-O-Wisp, which is fine. Our Horn Leeches will not be powerful anymore. But we, we pack Dazzling Gleam, so we're also especially attacking, which is fine. We're just defensive. Yo, the, the, the timer is actually toxic for these battles. They go way longer. I'm going to click toxic now. I don't think he goes into Excadrill. Like, no shot. He did see the Dazzling Gleam, but I do not think he goes into Excadrill. Probably Darmanitan. And Darmanitan will not appreciate this. Leah. Yeah, we haven't seen Leah yet. 
Ooh, Tangrowth. Hit the Toxic. Hit the Toxic. Hit the Toxic. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Um. Alright. Tangrowth is an issue. It's now neutered. Uh, we'll probably see a knockoff. Do we go Buster here? What do we do? Like, will a knockoff wreck us? It'll proc weakness policy before the item gets knocked off, right? I guess we'll find out. I mean, this is just for fun. I'm just enjoying battling, making Pokemon videos. Oh, big thank you for 1,900 subs. Like, that's crazy. I appreciate you guys all watching Sludge Bomb. Like, pretty good prediction there. Um. Yeah, I don't know what this thing can do to us. Do I just hit SD? I think I Shadow Claw. Oh, see, we're faster. Like, this is so weird. This set. Um. <clears throat> I think a knockoff does kill us now that we're this form. Yeah, for sure. Okay, I'm throwing. I'm throwing. Hmm. Now Leah just kind of pops off. Hmm. And we just want to buy some time. Is this Pokemon still good? <sighs> it's good against a lot of things. Man, I'm, I'm inting. I'm like taking my lead and I'm just throwing it away. All right, goes into Shofu. Able to take off the heavy duty boots. Do we have a Pokemon to sack? <clears throat> I think we sack Bulu. I think Scrapper's Intimidate is still important. I could be wrong. We also could have gone into Haiwan, actually. Which is our Primarina. Okay, made the prediction. Alright, we got rid of Sapu Bulu. I don't know what coverage Shofu gets. And Scrapper gets to come in now. And Intimidate. Alright, let's just click Earthquake here. Superpower. Okay. Okay, that's cool. Okay, how fast is our Manitan? <laughs> 95 base speed. Uh, yeah, we'll just go to Thunderous.
Uh, the rest of the Mons... Oof. Alright, we'll click Focus Blast. Loki expected a switch. Okay, he's got Excadrill. Base 88 speed, so we have to... Oh, he goes into Leah. Wait, Leah's an issue. Leah's a really big issue. I gotta click Psychic. Oh, Assault Vest is nuts. Wait, we lived a knockoff? You think we can live another move? I'm just gonna click Nasty Plot. Oh, I should have just brought Moltres. I've actually, I actually know how to use that Mon. Thunder ST looks so cool though. First time ever. I guess I should have hit NP. Sag. <laughs> oh man. I'm I'm glad Ritz doesn't really know what's going on in this tier either. Or else I feel like I just get manhandled by someone who does. Uh clearly we should have done that before. But now we just might get bopped by a sludge bomb. Maybe we live. Ooh, we live. But we get poisoned, Sag. Oh, you hate to see that. So I think from that distance, a Psychic might KO. It's non-stab, but plus two with our ridiculous special attack. Yeah, okay. We take out Leah. So now we got to hit a Focus Blast on Excadrill. What's Primarina's speed? Sixty. Oh no, dude. He's got Excadrill. He's got Rotom. Oh, this is just sad. Um. I think stab. Okay. We get rid of Rotom, which is huge. Oh, if we only we hit Nasty Plot first, we would have been in a better position. Um. All right, let's go, Cuckoo. Skawa. I think we beat Skawa. Mold Breaker, baby. I think I have to click Drain Punch. Rapid spins our ox away. That is fine. That'll KO Skawa. Yo, Kelder, Cuckoo, let's go, baby. And Pre Marina, who did nothing, does beat Moltres. Moltres, who is fast as heck. 90. 
Galarian Moltres, Dark Flying. Uh, I don't know if we live anything this Mon does, so I'm gonna just click Mock Punch here. I don't know what moves this Pokemon usually carries with it, too. Um, let's look. Fiery Wrath, Hurricane. Oh no, dude. Wait, that hurt. Now nah, we got high one. It comes down to Primarina and Moltres, dude. Let's kick a draining kiss. Miss? Hurricane miss? Oh no, okay. It might come down to confusion. Oh, it proc the weakness policy. No! And Berserk! Yeah, we lose. No, dude! Oh, I got we gotta see what happens. We gotta see what happens. Give us one more turn. No, we needed to see one more turn! Oh, and this battle ends in a draw due to the timer. Unfortunate. Down to the wire. The timer ruins it all. Let me know what you guys um, thought of the battle. I'm pretty sure Ritz beat me. Pretty sure. But uh, I appreciate you watching this video. Hope you guys had a great time. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.